What's up guys, it's Euphoria here. Today we're going to be looking at an electro bass line that sounds like this. Okay, um, first I just want to quickly say it's very important that you get a good melody with these type of things. They can sound really bad until you've got a good melody and then everything will just gel together and it'll sound pretty sick. We're going to sort of do it in the style of Tommy Trash, so uh, let's get going. So um, for oscillator 1, you want to put it on to duck organ. You want to pitch it down one octave. You want to turn the wavetable position down to about here leave the amp up and everything and then you want to change from where it's a spectrum to bend and the bend you want to use the minus and plus okay now um, this is an intermediate tutorial so I said I wouldn't explain these type of things but I'll quickly go over it okay uh, bend is pretty much going to bend the waveform okay whereas um, spectrum which is what it starts on is going to reduce like the harmonic content uh, rather than um, then bend it around so and I can't really remember what form it does um, I think it's like a sync kind of thing anyway um, so put that onto bend minus plus right and then you want to switch on oscillator 2 and put it onto sine and square turn the wave table position down to there put pitch on negative 24 putting that down two octaves and turning the amp down just a little bit. So now we have this so far. <laughs> Sounds very crunchy. Okay, so you want to leave all of this off, right? Go to insert one, switch it on, put on hard clipper, and push the draw wet and push the drive. Insert two, and you want to put a sound shaper on it and do the same thing, we push it a little more and quite a lot of drive okay then you want to put a classic tube on effects number one like this push the drive wet a tad push the drive a tad right effects two you want to put a dimension expander trusty dimension expander um, turn your drive wet down just a little bit and turn the size down just a little bit, we don't want that too wide it's sounding good right there, then we want to switch on our EQ push the low a little bit, push the boost a little bit make sure the frequency is set to sort of similar positions and you want to turn the high line just a little bit we can put a low pass 4 filter on here, we just turn the cutoff up just in case you want to you know, you know, filter it down okay, now Here's where it gets interesting. It's a very easy sound, so it won't take very long. But under oscillator, you want to switch on restart via gate. Right, that's what you want to do. And um, <laughs> we want to turn that down to about there. Um, and we also want to do something with the rating now um, when you initialize the sound um, it's going to do a whole bunch of different things um, when you just load massive then it, this is all set up differently so we've uh, initialized the sound because it's a good way to start um, and just the reason I pretty much did that was just so people would say that this makes no difference. It was like this. Now it sounds like this. That is the difference. And we go like that and we make sure that that is on. Right, so that's... So, um, so that's our sound. Um... Um, obviously going to save the file, you can get that on my Facebook page, this is the third video, so when I've done about 10, I'll upload the pack. Um, if you guys have any questions, leave some comments. Um, I didn't fiddle around too much with anything fancy, this was just setting things up, so this is kind of an easy sound, um, but feel free to go into it. Um,
maybe try some LFOs and various things. That's all up to you. But um, please like and subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. Um, yeah, so it's been Euphoria. Hopefully you guys learned something. Uh, keep well, everyone.